Hello guys, I hope you are all doing great. We are back. The Google Pixel 9 series, priced at $749 on Amazon, only recently launched, but attention is already shifting to what's next. Leaker Kamila Wojcikowska has unveiled information about the upcoming Pixel 10 and 11 series alongside their Tensor G5 and G6 chipsets. Reportedly, Google is planning a significant overhaul with the Tensor G6 chipset. Instead of using older fabrication technology, the Tensor G6 will adopt TSMC's N3P nodes, resulting in a smaller and more efficient die compared to its predecessors, Tensor G4 and G5. A major shift is expected in CPU design. The Tensor G6 will feature six ARM Cortex-X730 cores and one Cortex-X930 prime core, moving away from the usual three-cluster setup. Graphics performance will be driven by a three-core IMG CXT GPU, originally intended for the Tensor G4 and the chipset will include a reduced system cache. This change is aimed at boosting battery life and minimizing heat generation. These improvements indicate Google's focus on optimizing efficiency while also doubling down on artificial intelligence capabilities. It appears Google is committed to carving out a unique path with its tensor chip architecture, promising advancements but still leaving questions about real-world performance. In addition to that piece of news, a new report from Japan outlines the estimated bill of materials for Google's Pixel 9 Pro and Apple's iPhone 16 Pro. Focusing solely on component cost, the Pixel 9 Pro's BOM is said to be $406, significantly lower than the iPhone 16 Pro's at $568. Interestingly, the Pixel 9 Pro's parts cost has decreased by 11% compared to the Pixel 8 Pro, mainly due to its smaller screen and battery, which are less expensive. In contrast, the iPhone 16 Pro's BOM has risen by 6% from its predecessor. Notably, the iPhone's chipset is estimated at $135 its display at $110, and its camera components at $91. Meanwhile, the Pixel's SOC is $80 the display $75 and camera parts $61. Despite these cost disparities, both smartphones start at $999, reflecting different profit margins and strategic decisions. Note that such BOM figures are estimates and may not be fully accurate. That said, I'll be ending the discussion for today. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. The tech chat is over and I am out.